Hi, I'm Liz Nedden. Let's have a look at question 2b in the 2017 Level 2 Probability Exam. So here is our question. So we've got some information about lambs and it talks about how there's two breeds of sheep, Merino and Romney. So the table below that they've given us talks about the proportion of ewes that did not produce a lamb had a single birth or had multiple births for each breed of sheep. So we've got our two different breeds there, the Merino and the Romney, and we've got what the outcome was. So then, so that's the table, okay. Then we're told after the lambs are weaned, some of those were not kept, so they were culled, and others were kept for breeding in the following year. Then we've got some information in this new table about whether the Romney ewes were culled or kept and again whether they had no lambs single or multiple. Okay so two sets of tables. Now we've got another piece of information here. The ratio of Romney to Merino is in a ratio of 3 to 2. So 3 to 2 that means there are five pieces in total three parts, two parts, or five parts. So that's the same as a ratio of th a fraction of three fifths compared to a fraction of two fifths. And that's talking about Romney compared to Merino. Okay, so I've got these three different pieces of information, two tables and this ratio. We want an, the question now asks, what proportion of the total breeding use in the station were Romneys that were empty, so didn't produce a lamb, and were culled. Okay, so let's think about that. I want the probability of being a Romney and no lamb and culled. Okay, so that's the one that I want to find. All right, now remember and probability and means to multiply. So I need to find the probability of being in Rom a Romney lamb, uh, sorry, a Romney ewe, and the probability of not getting any lambs, and the probability of being culled. Okay, so those are the three things that I need to multiply together. So the first thing I know is probability of being Romney. So there is our three fifths. So that's going to be, so the probability is three fifths times. Now I need no lamb for the Romney. So I'm going to go back to this table here. So Romney's not getting a lamb is 0 0.06. And the probability of being culled so Romney ewes that were culled, that didn't have a lamb, is our 0.88. So I'm going to multiply those together, and that will give me 0 0.032. So in terms of marking, if you got part of it, so if you didn't know what to do with that fraction 3 fifths, but you managed to do that part of the calculation correct, that got you to a U, and if you get the answer correct, you did the whole thing, that gets you an R towards your merit. So then you can go through and work out your mark for this whole question. So 1U is N2, 2U's A3, 3U's A4, 1R M5, 2R's M6, 1T for E7, and 2T's for E8. So work that out, and that will give you a mark for question 2. Thanks for watching. Feel free to visit my website for more information and or subscribe to my channel below um, and there's a playlist there of further videos going through these answers to this exam.